Andy Lynch with Carly Sammons, the Wapakoneta native and now Bowling Green State University Falcon, president of FCA up at Bowling Green. How did that all come about? Uh, well, I started right when I got there. I knew I had to get involved with a Christian group of people, and Nick Hager was there, and so he's like, come to FCA. So I came, and I went to every single meeting, and they're like, Carly, like we really see your, your heart for Christ and everything you're doing, and you're so relatable. Like, Would you like to be a leader? And I was like, of course. And then one <laughs> of the... Um, presidents there's like two presidents and one of the presidents was like hey I'm leaving I'm going somewhere else would you like to take over my position and I was wow. like of course I would I would <laughs> love to so yeah it was really exciting so it, it took someone you knew inviting you out saying this is what I'm doing just right. how important is that to have a connection oh so important because I the first couple weekends I didn't I didn't really know what to do because I knew I didn't want to go to parties or do the whole drinking thing and whatever and so um, having that one person to say, hey, come meet my friends, you know, come meet the people that you, you want to be with and that you want to hang out with. And, and so that was really crucial of Nick to do, and I'm so glad that God blessed me with him. So. What are some of the things Bowling Green's FCA is doing on the campus and there in the community? Um, we have a thing called Campus Outreach that we've been trying to get more people to do. And basically what we do is um, we go to the Union, which is like a big building, and um, we just try and evangelize to people and just have a conversation, even if it doesn't turn out to be a Christian conversation, mm -hmm. just a conversation to get to know people, make connections with them, invite them to FCA, um, reaching athletes. We're going to try and have um, meetings with a lot of the FCA coaches up in Bowling Green so we can talk to more because we we're trying to get you know a couple athletes from each sport so that way we can get each sport involved and then more people and so I'm hoping that the coaches are all on board and it goes yeah. great so what are some of those conversations like in the union pretty interesting I would imagine uh yeah because you <laughs> at Bowling Green there's so many different types of people so you get people who are totally open to the conversation and we'll talk about it and we've had a couple of salvations which is great awesome. and then um you know you have the people who are like I'm an atheist or yeah. I don't I don't believe in what you do or I don't even want to talk to you or and some people when we sit down they know who we are so they just <laughs> look away and don't even don't even look at us they so. pretend you're not there right exactly <laughs> <laughs> which is kind of awkward but yeah. then you just move on to the next person you know you pray about it you pray for them and then move on so God teaches you a lot through those moments doesn't he Oh yeah, and it really it really tests your patience and Satan really tries to tell you, you know, you're not doing anything. Even if we didn't have one Christian conversation, Satan goes, "Well, you didn't even reach anybody today." Well, yeah, we did because we showed people that we cared. We were there, you know, just to talk or be there, or, you know, they know who we are. We invited them to come, so yeah. Yeah. Your dad started the FCA at Wapakoneta High School. You were all the way up through 8th grade. Is that when you started? <laughs> yes. Oh, yes. How much of an impact did that have on your life and then going forward to college? Oh, well, there's so much I could say about that. Um, just getting the opportunities to serve and, and give and love people and, and an opportunity to lead. Um, I think all that are qualities that, that Jesus possessed and being given the opportunities to be like Jesus um, really showed me that there's more to life than athletics. Even though it is Fellowship of Christian Athletes, yeah, I think the whole point is to show people that you know, there's more to life than just being an athlete. You know, you should be a Christian first and, and serve like Jesus and give like Jesus and love like Jesus. And so that was really important, especially in high school with all the turning points, getting your driver's <laughs> license, making decisions, where are you going to go to college? I think, I think um, having a Christian group there to be able to be there for those turning points because it makes them turn to Jesus. So. You're feeling old. You're getting so old, Carly. I know. I know I am. I know I am. <laughs> Carly Sammons, FCA president of Bowling Green State University.